it is a very lengthy and dense lawsuit, and it's a lot to digest and process. 86 pages long, to be exact. The lawsuit filed by Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton and two professors working for the University of Texas at Austin is challenging the Biden administration over recent changes made to Title IX. This challenge in this lawsuit is alleging in part that uh, the Department of Education has gone beyond their authority. Title IX is a federal law which bans discrimination of students based on their race, gender, and sexual orientation. In 2021, President Biden revisited Title IX, adding a rule that public colleges should excuse absences for women accessing abortion care. The professors named in the suit argue this violates their First Amendment right. Texas Values President Jonathan Sines says the new Title IX provisions overstep state laws. Texas is a pro-life state. We pass pro-life laws. Abortion is illegal. The lawsuit also says professors shouldn't be required to use they, them pronouns for students who identify as non-binary. Planned Parenthood senior advisor Wendy Davis says this puts vulnerable students at risk. We are a state now that is saying to students, we are going to be the very bullies that you fear. So what's next? Well, Texas attorney Walker Herman says the suit won't go far. There will likely be um, a motion to dismiss from the Biden ad administration. Something the American Association of University Professors agree with. And so it's now up to the plaintiffs to make their case that the education department has gone beyond their authority. And I don't think that they have really any merit to their allegations. Reporting in Austin, Abigail Velez, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.